Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Binisaya with Island Girl. In this episode, we will talk about commuting. Commuting is a big part of our lives in the Philippines. A lot of us here commute to work, to school, to shop, to visit families and friends, and to travel around. Today, you will learn how to commute like a native. Let's get started. First, let's start with the means of transportation in the Visayas region. There's the bus jeepney or jeep the most popular means of transportation in the philippines multi-cab a small version of a jeepney van an alternative to bus then there's the taxi or uber or grab trike or tricycle we also call this motor can fit five to nine people and the pedicab or tricycad can only travel to short distances and habal habal the bike version of a taxi to flag down a vehicle just stick your arm out and wave to get the driver's attention to flag down in binisaya is paraha paraha ang sakyanan paraha ang sakyanan flag down the vehicle para asa ka ma'am sir para asa ka ma'am sir in english where would you like to go ma'am sir ato ko sa ayala ato ko sa ayala i'm going to ayala some people here would also say ato ko sa ayala kuya ato ko sa ayala kuya Kuya is what we used to call an older brother or any older male. When you're riding a vehicle that carries a lot of passengers like a jeepney or multicab and you want to pay your fare, all you need to do is pass your money to the person next to you and say, Palihog ko sa pliti, salamat, or pliti palihog, salamat, fare please, thank you. In the same jeep near Maltica Bride, when you give a 20 peso bill and the fare is only 7 pesos, the driver will normally ask, Pila ni kabuok? How many people? You can say, Usa lang? Only one? Or duha? Two? Sometimes he will ask, Para asa ni? Para asa ni? Where to? And you can tell the driver the destination so he can give you the right change. One thing you'll notice about Bisaya people is that we keep our answers short as much as possible. So for this question, we answer it with the name of the place we're going. Market. Mercado. Mercado kuya. Mercado bay. Bay is buddy in English. Once you arrive at your destination to make the driver pull over, you just say, Lugar lang, which is equivalent to saying, pull over here or stop here. There are vehicles that mount destination signs in front of them or right on top of the roof. There are also others that don't. If it's your first time to travel in a certain place, always ask the driver or the driver's conductor or assistant to see if they go to that certain destination. The conductor is the person who collects the fare. You will see them in buses, vans, jeepneys, and sometimes in multicabs. I hope you had fun learning our commuting topic today. If there are certain topics that you want me to cover to better prepare you for your trip here, just comment them below. All my Binisaya lessons can be accessed in Binisaya with Island Girl playlist. I added the link of the playlist in the description box below. If you have any questions or suggestions, do comment them below. If you like this video, please hit like, subscribe, and don't forget to click on the bell button. Magkita ta sa sunod na video. Ayo ayo!